Are you ready for some delicious saffron chicken? Get ready. The plane is taking off. Let's go to Morocco. As I always do, I like to remind people to be sure to wash the chicken. We're going to start with a few basic ingredients. With some salt. And then we're going to add some black pepper. I like to use a lot of black pepper. I love black pepper. It's spicy. And then what you want to do is you want to massage your salt and pepper into the chicken. Now what we want to do is we want to add some extra virgin olive oil into our pan. Put it on a medium heat and then gently place the chicken into the frying pan. Be careful because it splatters a little bit. And you want to brown this on both sides. But you don't want to cook it all the way through just yet. After we've taken our chicken out, we're going to put a little butter in the pan, let it melt down in the olive oil. And then we're going to use some chopped onions. We're going to cook these onions. We're going to put a little garlic paste in there. You can use garlic, real garlic, three cloves. Then I add a, a ginger paste. You can get these at the store, real easy. Let that caramelize. And then we're going to use about a half a teaspoon of paprika. Put a nice little pretty color in there. Stir it around. I love the smell of fried onions. It smells so good. This music just makes you just want to bop. Yeah. Right now, we're going to use about mm, a fourth of a teaspoon of some cayenne pepper. Sprinkle it in there. Oh, clean up on all five. <laughs> Put some cayenne pepper in here, y'all. Stir it around. Stir it up. Just like that. Now I'm going to use one small block of Maggie seasoning. You can get this seasoning at your local grocery store or maybe you have an international store. You want to use one small block, make a paste out of it, put it in there. Start to really get that Moroccan flavor. Up next, I'm going to use one tablespoon of flour. And then I'm going to add in about two cups of chicken broth. Maybe a little over two cups. Pour that in there. Stir it all around. And this makes our gravy. Then we'll put in a little parsley. Up next is the mash, saffron seasoning. You can buy this again at your international store. Pretty expensive seasoning. It's one of the most expensive seasonings in the world. You just want to sprinkle just a few little of those saffron strands into your gravy. Mmm, it smells so good. Now we're going to place the chicken that we browned on both sides earlier back into the pan. Cover and let it simmer for about 45 minutes. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen, internationally known as Saffron Chicken. Oh, it looks so beautiful and it smells so delicious. Tonight we're going to add on a little bit of a collard greens here, butter rice, 
And as my brothers in India say, Namaste. See you next time. I'm your boy, Kenny Jones.